Hi, in this session I'm going to cover how to format a zip code. So in this instance sometimes you have a zip code that maybe you're entering in or you're expecting other people to enter in in a certain definable format. So for example in the United States we have a nine digit zip code um, that's five digits long in the first instance uh, and followed by a dash and then followed by four digits. Now sometimes if you're doing some, you're expecting someone to do some data entry for you maybe it's easier for them just to type in all the digits and expect the cell to automatically add that dash in. Well that could be done and that is actually done with some cell formatting. So what we want to do is we want to say for instance type in in this example 9805 two six three nine nine and expect there's a dash in between there's no dash here well the way to do that automatically is to change the cell format so what we want to do is you want to right click go into format cells and there is a special category and we have a zip code type and it automatically does it for you here so you can see that it does it for you so what if you are not in the United States and you have addresses that are different so basically you have to make your own custom cell format so to do that let's say for example I put this cell in here I do one two two zero zero two but in uh, the this zip code for India actually it's a space that separates the the first three digits from the rest so what you want to do is you want to right click go into format cells and go to custom and in custom it lets you put in your own type in this field here so what you want to do is use the pound sign and the pound sign is just a digit placeholder so we want three pound signs and then a space and another three pound signs and you just have to click OK and now it's done it for you so if you had to provide a sheet for someone to do some data entry for you you can format the cells like that so hope that helps. Thanks for watching.